for review today, the Hunter Pod System. Yeah, another pod device. This one comes to me from Boar. So this is the, the Boar Hunter. That's why I have my Hunter Orange hat on today. Since most of the stuff is sold online, not really a big deal, but if this was in a retail store, would you get it? Like, I kind of want to be able to see my device, not just the, the cartridge. Fine, I'll give you a better look at the back of the box so you can see the kit contents. One thing that does disappoint me is that I don't see the battery capacity of this device, which is 360 milliamp hours inside of this thing, which looks like, well, look at this. An alien head. It also tells me that there's a ceramic and a cotton cartridge. I don't have the resistance on here or the capacity. If I'm in a store and I'm not talking about online and I pick this up, I'm not able to open it until I buy it. So I would like more info on the box. Behold, as I use my last remaining nail to open the box. Inside of the box, there is a warning card, user manual, and warranty card. The warranty is good for three months and it is for defective products. The device will come in six different colors and over here is a couple of interchangeable side panels which come off when you just stick your nail in here and pop it off. It would be cool if the manual mentioned the panels aside from the place where it says contents but that is the only, there is no instructions on how to take these things off. Probably looks like a blank piece of paper if I show it to you like that but here you go. This is basically the full manual. There's two sides to it. Cartridges or pods on this thing, they pop out like this and they come out like really easily. This thing is held on by magnets. But yeah, I just feel like it's, it's just too loose. So one of these cartridges, this one, is cotton. That's what's inside. The other one, Taking a closer look at the pod, you can see that there there is no markings on this. There was no markings on the little package either. You pretty much just have to look at them. And this is the ceramic one, which is 1.2 ohms. But if you're new to vaping, how are you gonna know which one's which? I think I think they should be labeled. These little cartridges are bottom filling. It's got this little rubber stopper right there. That pulls up and it does stay attached. The hole is really tiny, but with a bottle like this, there's no issue filling the cartridge. Once you have a brand new cartridge filled up, give it like three minutes so that e-liquid can saturate. So here it is with the cotton cartridge, and this thing is really simple. It's draw activated. I don't have any buttons. The only thing on here, well, besides the cartridge, is a USB port for charging. It's a 360 milliamp hour battery and I don't think it has fast charging because the manual says this takes like three hours for a full charge. I've never fully charged it. I just kind of charge it once it's like halfway. But um, yeah, that's, that's crazy. Three hours seems like a really long time for such a small battery. You can see when I'm vaping, a light turns on. Right now it's green. Green means the battery is pretty much good. It's between like 60 to 100% power. If you keep using it, it'll eventually turn blue. Then it'll be between like 10 and 60% power and red, you gotta recharge it. The light's there whether you want it or not. I do like the removable panels of this. I am a big fan of. I want more devices to have interchangeable panels in a bunch of different colors. And I would also like to know where, where to get them because right now I, I don't. I really haven't been able to find much on this device except for the company website and I know that Logomall has these for around like $28, $29. I've already lost the panels that came with this one. Mine came with black ones and then that gold one I just showed you guys. This one came with some fun rainbow colored ones. Maybe somewhere on the side, tell me what color is inside, you know, in case the manual, the color of the, of the device in case the manual's in the way, and the panels as well. The pull on this, it's nice. It's like not too airy, not too restrictive. It's like right in the middle and it feels really smooth. Now, if you're chain vaping this thing or taking a really long hit, you might feel the heat of the e-liquid, so you, d you do have to be careful because it does get a little bit hot. But if you're just taking little hits, 
you're not gonna feel it. And this one is the ceramic coil. Now with this, that first hit, it's really not much of one. The second one is, yeah. You're gonna have to hit it a couple times just to get the vapor going and then a few more times to get the best flavor out of it. So that's it. There's the Hunter Pod System by Boar. I, I kind of like pod systems because, because they're so simple. And simple gets smokers into vaping, which, which I like. So, so that's it. If you guys want to find me elsewhere, I'm also on Facebook, Twitter, Instagram, and my other silly channel called Just Sophie. Bye guys. Toodle-oodle-ee-loos.